All right, everyone, let's go over the bike again, and I noticed the Screaming Eagle intake. Not sure in the last time it's been cleaned. I know it was a little um, rusted or pitted there on that cap. Clean that up, but I want to uh, clean it and re-oil it. I was looking at the Harley website where they sell the Screaming Eagle intake, and they recommend the K&N cleaning products. So that's what I've got here. Just this K&N recharger kit. We're going to go ahead and uh, start cleaning it. Okay, I'm going to loosen up the filter and remove it. I can get the camera to focus, this is what it looks like before. We're going to use. It says to spray liberally and let sit for 10 minutes. Okay. Okay, after 10 minutes they say to rinse the cleaner out of the intake filter and I say not to use a nozzle but I can't get this one off so we're going to do it with very low pressure and they say to go until uh, it runs clean. Okay, well, that filter has filter has a lot going on. That water is pretty filthy. Watch out for the water. Do you need more? <laughs> Look at that filter water, and that's filled up pretty high, so it's diluted, but it's still very dirty. All right, we've let it dry for a full day. We're gonna go ahead and start reoiling. <laughs> Come on. Don't tell me. Just squeeze it really hard, bro. Yeah, look, he's so yeah, he's so dumb, bro. <laughs> don't forget to open the cap, boys. This calls for a thin bead across each fin. Oops. I may have actually found out how to make my brother's camera focus. Here is the final product. Finished cleaning up this Screaming Eagle. Looks a lot better. A lot better and it's going to perform better too. The last thing we got for this heavy breather is this uh, rain cover. Didn't come with one. Let's go ahead and get it open and toss it on. Thank you.
Alright, that's it for today's video. Got the rain cover on the heavy breather, and it's all done. Tune in next time.